Hello and welcome back to Little Show Big Ideas. Um, it has been a very long time since I've posted a video. Uh, there's been a few different reasons for that. Um, I've had a couple of kids. Um, obviously the world has kind of fallen apart a little bit, so that's made some massive changes to, to everyone's lives. Um, and just general things in life have got in the way. Um, one of the factors as well really was just some of the, the crappy comments you get when you do YouTube. Lots of people just moaning at what I do. Um, and it just kind of demotivates you a little bit, but I've been watching a lot of YouTube again recently and it's kind of given me a kick up the backside and re-inspired me to, to get back into doing this. Um, I just thought I'd just share a few of the channels that I kind of watch just in case anyone is interested, but I guess you probably already know them, um, which is the Badger Workshop. Great little channel. Um, really like watching it, some of the tool reviews and some of the projects that, uh, that he builds. Um, Rag and Bone Brown as well. Some of the stuff that Keith does is fantastic and the fact been able to watch his um, shop field over the last kind of year or so and how that's changed and how that's moved on has become really good. Uh, and then one that I found recently as well, uh, an American guy called Shop Nation. Uh, I've been watching his channel as well, so that's uh, that's really interesting. And, and, you know, he's inspired me to really kind of how I'm going to lay out and how I'm going to kit out my... Uh, my new workshop with my workbench and my cabinets and bits and pieces as well. So hopefully um, over the next kind of few months or so, then um, I'll get to show you my new workshop, which I'm currently sitting in now. Uh, moved out of the old little shed just because essentially it got too small really when I kind of thought, you know, let's do this a bit more properly. I need a bit more space to be able to do it. So I'm currently sitting here now. I will give you a little tour. I'll go a bit hands-free in a second and show you around. Um, but essentially it's just, slightly bigger than a one car garage what I've moved into. Um, hopefully you'll kind of get the idea of uh, what it's all about. So uh, thank you for being patient and staying with me. Um, I think when I did my last video I had about 103 subscribers. It's gone up to 300 now which I know in the grand scale of things isn't a lot but I think that's pretty uh, pretty amazing really to be honest with you for, for essentially some of the some of the dribble that I set put out into, into YouTube. So like I say I'll uh, I'll give you a quick little tour around so you can see what I kind of have set up and, and what I've got around me. Um, and then hopefully, like I say, over the next few videos, I can kind of film a little bit more about what I've done, why I've done it, and um, how I'm building up my uh, my workshop. Okay, so this is uh, what was my carport. Uh, first thing I'll just quickly show you, excuse all the rubbish and the mess around, but is um, I got a, a roller door, garage door put on, um, which just made life a little bit easier. I did cross my mind for about all of five minutes to build myself some uh, wooden doors, but I just kind of thought that might be a little bit more on my level. Plus, this is a little bit of luxury. Um, got it from a local company uh, to me. Um, and then this is kind of the, the rest of it, really. This is going to be kind of one of my, my main workbenches when it's eventually finished. That kind of goes down and continues down to, to this end. Um, as you can see, the, the, old, uh, the old little shed is uh, just over there. Um, and then it just kind of goes over, a bit of timber storage, built myself uh, my first workbench, kind of, like I say, apologies, everything is a bit of a bit of a mess at the moment, but you'll kind of get the idea of what it will, uh, what it will be like when it's uh, done. Uh, but I have filmed myself building some of these units and such, so I'll do a little uh, video just about those and how I did it and what I did. Um, but yeah, that's kind of how things are. Let's call this kind of day one, I suppose, really.